Hi, welcome back to the channel. I am certified life coach Talia Sage using science and spirituality to help you create your best life possible. Today's video message will be about the new moon in Capricorn that's happening on December 23rd. This moon is the perfect time to really make those New Year's resolutions. Don't wait until the new year. Do it now. It's creating the perfect energy for us to lay the solid foundations that we need in order to make those impossible dreams possible. So before we get into the good stuff about this energy, let's talk a bit about the not so great stuff. Um, the things that we might come up against, we might experience, we might feel within ourselves that we might have to work through. So the first thing that you might notice within yourself or other people around you is that there might be some single-mindedness going on, some very self-centered uh, energies happening. And that's just because we're all going to be, or not all of us, but most of us will be so focused on the next year ahead, cre um, accomplishing those things that we maybe didn't accomplish this year, setting those goals for ourselves, setting those plans into motion. So if you experience people not being as readily available as you would like, or if you maybe have people coming to you saying how you're not available, give them grace, give yourself grace, and know that it's just the energies that are going on right now. And a lot of us just really aren't aware of it, but those of you who watch this video will be aware of it and you will be better able to adapt and work with it, work around it even. Uh, the next thing is the sign of Capricorn is that devil in tarot. And that devil energy is all about those low vibe things, the habits, the routines, the negative self-talk, the laziness that prevents us from getting out and doing things, um, even giving in to addictions. So around this time, keep an eye on those things. Keep an eye on how you are choosing to soothe yourself, how you are dealing with any mishaps that come up, how you're speaking to yourself. Right now is really the time going into the new year to be extra positive and um, to really believe in yourself that you can accomplish the things that you want to set out for yourself. Now is the perfect time with this new moon to really reassess your life, reassess what happened in 2022, what worked well, what did not, what you'd like to take forward with you in the year 2023, and what should be left behind in 2022. Um, just really learning those lessons from the past and taking what you need and leaving the rest behind. Just like I say in my pick a card videos, take what resonates, leave the rest for someone else, right? This is the perfect time for all of us to really start laying those solid foundations for ourselves, to start writing out um, those strategic action steps on how we feel, on what we feel we need to do to accomplish our goals, um, you know, and even setting those goals for yourself. Have your final destination in mind, so to speak, for the end of the year for 2023, and then write down some action steps on what you need to accomplish by when. What do you want to get accomplished um, by that first week of February, three months from then, six months from then, so on and so forth. However, you need to break it down for yourself so it doesn't seem so overwhelming of a challenge that you cannot accomplish it because you really can do whatever you set your mind to. It's just breaking it down into simple steps, easier steps, so it doesn't seem so overwhelming. Once again, this energy is going to, the energy of the new moon, if we choose to work with it, will help us to be more disciplined. Once again, those action steps that you can write down for yourself will help us to stay focused because we will know our plan. If, so, if a wrench gets thrown in, it won't be able to take us so far off of our course because we already have our plan set, written plainly for all to see, right? Um, and also the new year just really brings in that confidence of newness, newness and new beginnings and being able to reach that impossible dream. Mercury will go retrograde on December 29th. So that energy will 
show us all where things have not been working most effectively in our lives and where uh, the things that we can change to work better for us in the future. So keep an eye out um, during that time of the Mercury retrograde anything that comes up that seems as though it's just not working, that's where you want to make those mental notes or write down in your journal even of where you need to change or do something differently. And that's really the energy of this new moon in Capricorn on December 23rd. Remember, slow and steady wins the race. Don't rush things that you want to last a long time because starting the year out starting the year out is when we can really set those steps, set those wheels in motion to accomplish what we want to accomplish by the end of 2023. If you'd like some help creating those uh, plans for yourself, setting those goals for yourself, feel free to find my email down in the description box. You can reach out to me for a coaching session and I will see you then. Goodbye.